Overthinking can be a real challenge for many of us. Um, for some, it can even be really intense and seemingly unending. In today's video, I want to give you a process uh, to change how you approach times of overthinking in your life. So what is overthinking? Um, in many ways, it is looped thinking, which struggles to con conclude. It goes in a loop and then it repeats itself. Overthinking also involves like inner tension and emotional energy. It's not just the thoughts, it's the emotional energy associated with those thoughts. And also this emotional energy can have different levels for different people. And then this emotional energy can make the thinking very intense and very fast. As a kid, I overthought an awful lot. I struggled very much in personal relationships and I would bring overthinking and this looped thinking that I mentioned um, into my thoughts about relating to others. Um, and often it was emotionally intense for me and the thought of uh, I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do, would loop and loop and loop. Um, and I struggled intensely with it. But over the years, I've learned how to cut through this thinking, um, both in this area and in other areas of my life. Um, and it's very much so about your relationship with yourself, with the thoughts, with the emotions, and just bringing a different frame to the whole situation. So let's discuss this process um, that will support you with your overthinking and approaching it in a new way. The first part of the process is to become aware of the emotional energy that we've been discussing, to take your awareness from the thinking and actually allow yourself to be present with the emotional energy that's often in your chest area. You aren't going to think your way out of this problem. So move away from those thoughts and come to this energy instead. Your mind isn't going to fix it. Um, that's what it's trying to do. And it's trying to do that to dissipate this energy. But instead, simply come and bring your consciousness to the energy within um, and just allow it to be present for a few moments. So now that you have moved from the thoughts to bring awareness to the energy, the second step of the process, this change of approach for you is to find truth to speak to the emotional energy within. As you sit with the emotional energy, you might recognize that there is fear about what's going on. Um, for me as a kid, it was fear of what other people thought of me. Um, and it was also this intense fear that there was no solution. Okay, so as I rest in that, and as we rest and allow the energy, what truth is there that you can speak? Simple truths such as I am safe. Simple truths such as there is a way out. I know what to do. And these aren't um, analytical thoughts. These are aware truths um, that we provide to ourselves in a new way. So this is our second step. We take some time with the energy and we speak truth into it. So having done this second step and speaking this truth, um, the energy will have dissipated to some extent. Take as long as you feel you need to allow the energy to decrease to allow it to move through your body um, and to find the place of peace within, okay? 
And then our third step is you make the decision and move on. A lot of overthinking is in advance of a decision. We think and think and think. We go back and forth. We loop around and around and around. All trying to make a decision, but also not making a decision. And in effect, the way our minds work is that when we make the decision, our thoughts can deal with that better. They can go more focused towards the goal at that point because you've decided and then the release happens in terms of any remaining energy and then your whole being can focus on moving forward. When you're thinking in advance of the decision, you're almost stifling yourself and not permitting yourself to move forward. So this third step is choosing to make the decision that you've been avoiding um, through your overthinking so that you permit yourself to move on. And the decision can be as simple as um, I accept things as they are right now. Or it could be as simple as I don't need to do anything. Simply make the decision and move forward. Well, that is the approach that I'm offering to you today to reframe and come from a different angle towards your overthinking, to support you in releasing the thoughts um, and finding a way to move forward. Um, to repeat the three step process, um, firstly, you move from the thinking to bring awareness to the emotional energy within. You allow that energy to be present and come to your awareness. Secondly, you speak truth to the emotional energy. Allow truth and knowledge to come from within, to dissipate the energy, to release the energy. And then from that place, you make a decision. You choose with courage and you move forward. So I really hope this supports you. Um, if overthinking has been a problem for you um, in your life, I know the challenges, the stresses of it, um, the difficulties that we can have with it. Um, and I really want to support you in finding a new way forward um, to, to bring release and, and more freedom into your life. Um, thanks very much for watching today. Please subscribe if you want to um, hear more of my thoughts on um, how to bring transformation to your life and um, find a way forward in consciousness for you. Uh, thanks again for watching and I'll certainly speak to you again soon.